You could only kill him with special weapons because he's a god. Alright, so basically the first place I need to go to... Alright. I don't know if I'll die if I fall in here. Yep. Alright, let me just load up my game. Potions that I purchased in Vivek are required uh, to proceed up once uh, you reach a, a higher level of the mountain. Like I'm in the Red Mountain region, which is where you get the Keening and the Sunder. And I basically need to... ...controls online, because like I could just go from being super powerful to like... Not super powerful, but enjoying the graphics anyway. I'm gonna try going up this way. I basically ran up from here, from Ghost Gate, go to the left a little bit. Let's check out over here, maybe Veminal's over here. That kind of looks like Veminal a little bit. I might use a quality rising force potion over here. Alright, so this is an area. Hopefully this is Veminal right here. Oh, this is Endusil. Um, wrong. Endusol? No. I'm tired of all these haters in there. Oh, so if you go to the left over here, this is actually how you get over uh, directly to where the Keening is located. Um, you just run up here, and then you'll find the Keening. Just have to run over here. Kill some cliff racers. this bridge, I like three, three bridges, it's like Jeff Bridges, or Jeff Goldblum. Which is also, like hilarious also, by the way. And not racist. Alright, so that was the path to, here's Dagath Ur again, so that's how you get to Dagath Ur, which is right over here, and uh, to enter you basically use a rising force potion right here, and then you could float, so you're going to float, and you're going to go over here, and you see this right here? This is where you go in. Let me just kill this quick racer real quick. It's trying to pay in my video. Alright, and then uh, you go over here, and you basically crank this Dwarven crank, and that opens up the Dagath Earth facility. You just stand in here, and it'll close, and then you're able to enter once you turn around. Um, but I'm not going to stand in it and go in this time. So that's how you get to Dagath Ur. And then to get to...
to get to the Keening, you basically go to the right of here, you go over here, and you make a left up here. And you drop down here, and you jump on this bridge, and go to the right. And this is how you go to the Keening from the Dagathur facility. I'm just getting stuck on the bridge again. Alright, so now that they blinded you, um, Basically, you go over here, and this is kind of where the Keening is in Odrasal. Right here on the map, right over here. Dealing all my loot. And here is the Keening, which I need to kill Dagath Ur. Um, but I need obviously the Wraith Guard in order to wield it. So, one second, let me just take a selfie with it. So, this is me standing next to the Keening. Um, it's a very powerful short blade, and if you have uh, it, you can kill Dagath Ur. So I'm gonna use my exclusive rising force here. I'm gonna save first though, in case it isn't the right way. Whatever you do. So obviously you're gonna to wanna to go near like the ghost gate uh, with the fang tusks. That's the only way you could possibly find the place, otherwise you're kind of uh, wasting everyone's time. Gonna take the high ground over here real quick. And then look at the map again. Because the whole thing is basically want to kill Dagath there. It's a little bit more south from here, so it's directly this way. Alright, so I found it. So, let me just all right so basically from Argon you basically run over to the east and then you fly over and then you run south from right here and to there And it's right here on the map, uh, the next area you need to go to. This is Veminal, uh, Veminal Outer Fortress. You just run east of Margon after teleporting from Balmora to Aldrun, and then from Aldrun to Margon. You run east, you use an exclusive rising force potion. 
you run east of Margon, you use a Rising Forest Potion, and then you go over the Ghost Gate, and then you go south, and you're at Veminol. You go in here, here's a, what the local map looks like. Perfect. All right. Alright, so you basically run along down here, ignore this guy completely, run in here, ignore this guy. Just keep going down to the Hall of Torque. Um, run to the left, look at this door, don't go in it. Go over here, if you watch my How to Get to Mournhold video. Potions, exclusive health potions uh, for that specific. So go in here and basically you just have to defeat this dude and you get the Sunder. So I destroyed Dagoth Venom, Vem, Vemin, and I take the Sunder from him. And I'm just going to take his Amulet of Heart Heal as well. Um, so I have Amulet of Heart Fire and Amulet of Heart Heal. So I have both the amulets. My journal has been updated. And at this point, you can kind of leave here. Um, you could appreciate this uh, for a moment. Take a selfie with it. Do whatever you want. So I'm just going to leave this area also real quick. Let's go through here. Check out the skeleton. Just run out. And you're done. So all that's really left to do is kind of escape Ghost Gate. Um, so you have to run all the way down. So I basically took this unique Dwemer artifact from Vivek, who I killed. And uh, yeah, now I'm going to go to Telfire and I'm going to transform this unique Dwemer artifact into a Wraith Guard, which will let me wield the Keening and the Sunder to kill Dagoth Ur. Um, so obviously uh, Vivek has all these plans over here on how to kill Dagoth Ur. I think uh, free will... And uh, basically I just need to run to tell fire. So tell runs way farther for sure. Only, only noobs go that way. So I'm just gonna fly right there. Now that I got all these bargains with the boys. I'm just gonna drink my coffee on this shit. I'll make a an alternate route of me just walking here in the air. Right to this fat motherfucker. Alright. Oh, I need to go to the left. I need that. Come to the right. And he's straight ahead. Big prey. All right, so I got all the stuff this dude needs. He needed uh, and uh, so Yagram Bagarn, you basically show him the unique Dwemer artifact that you got from Vivek, killing Vivek. Do you know what that is? That is Wraithguard, an enchanted device created ages ago by my former master, Mythopoic Enchantments. I'm not sure I can explain. In a search for the secrets of immortality, I don't think this artifact is working. Can you restore the artifact? I'm not sure, but let me see. 
No, I don't think so. Not without Kagernak's plan book and Kagernak's journals. Compelling reason. So Kagernak's plan book, Kagernak's journals. Kagernak recorded every step in his manufacture and testing of enchanted items. Oh, okay. So... Potions that I purchased in Vivek are required uh, to proceed up once uh, you reach a, a higher level of the mountain. Like, I'm in the Red Mountain region, which is where you get the Keening and the Sunder, and I basically need to... ...controls online, because, like, I could just go from being super powerful to, like, not super powerful, but enjoying the graphics anyway. I'm gonna try going up this way. I basically ran up from here, from Ghost Gate, go to the left a little bit. Check out over here, maybe Veminol's over here. That kind of looks like Veminol a little bit. I might use a quality rising force potion over here. Alright, so this is an area. Hopefully this is Veminal right here. Alright, defeated. Run through this door, go to the left over here, ignore everyone, open this door. There's nothing nowhere they never um, go over here. And right over here you got Daggett Endis. And he drops the amulet of heart rhyme, so I'm gonna take that from him. You got the Dwemer Centurion plans, which I grab here. You got the special flora of Tamriel. And you got the Nagast Kavada Kavakis. Um, some like random you got silence here. I've heard of you, said the old vagabond very Okay, whack. Kagernak's journal, the contents of Kagernak's journal. So I got Kagernak's journal. Take that. And now I just need to go to another place and get another thing. So glass boots, already got those. Roll. Just gotta run in here and get the other Kagernak thing and then get out of here. So here's Turia Neural, it's northeast of Dagathur. You need to use a levitation spell to get here. And just run in. It's very useful. So you just go straight. Alright, so I hit my strength, so I'm gonna use my restore strength potions. Right, here's Kagernak's plan book. So you take Kagernak's plan book, and now I have both the items needed. So just a straight run out. Kagernak's plan book and journals. All right. Got all that. You found Kagernak's journals and Kagernak's plan book. Good. I'll take them and study them. It shouldn't take long. Give me a day, then come back, and I think I can restore Wraith Guard's myopic enchantments. So after re resting for 25 hours right here, I basically talk to Yagram Bagarn again, and I'm gonna select Myopic Enchantments. I've studied Kagernak's plan book and journal. Please activate my Wraith Guard very well. Yagram Bagarn takes a unique Dwemer artifacts. Let me try equipping this shit. Didn't even do anything. I didn't even feel it. All right, now let me equip the Keening. Hell yeah, dude. Go kill Daggett there. Hell yeah. Going right over here. Gans of Daggett there is so simple, it's straight up. 
straight up with the boys. Alright, so enter in the Dagather facility. I'm gonna save the Dagather as you run right down. I'm just gonna complete this dude real quick. Until healed. Do speed, endurance, agility. Okay. Alright, so we basically run down here. Go over here to the left. Run down, go over here, go to the inner facility, and basically what you're going to do is you're going to run down, go right, go right again, and then go further down. Run over here to the lower facility, jump across, go in here, and Dagather is right in the mine. It looks like a Resident Evil 7 mine. So he's right here. I'm just gonna save real quick. Call it a uh, Dagath Ur. And basically, the first time you fight him, you just have to defeat him normally. So I'm gonna go over here and cast invisibility. Uh, since I'm a moon shadow main, or whatever it's called. So I'm sneaking, I'm invisible. I'm gonna hit him with a powerful hit. Now I'm gonna. Use health potions. Just keep swinging at him. And after the first time after you defeat him, he runs away, this door opens. You gotta make sure you look at him too while beating him up. Um, so yeah, there's really nothing over here. Over here, there's a uh, heart ring, which uh, you need to beat him. So I'm going to rest until healed. And it looks like there's a, uh, a door here. So he kind of took away a few of my stats. Can you kill a god? So basically use a rising force. I'm gonna hit it once with the Sunder, and I'm gonna hit it a few times with the Keening until it starts to disappear. And I gotta And then I'm gonna hit it a few times with the Keening, about five times until it, it breaks. And uh You'll notice it, it'll break right in front of your face. Let me just heal a bit. So I destroyed the heart of Lorcan. So now I'm able to fight uh, Dagather normally because he doesn't have uh, unfair amounts of health. So I'm going to switch my weapon to my main. And now Dagather can recharge. So, I'm able to kill him, and uh, he's dead now. Um, so here's Akula Khan, I don't know what that is. Um, so yeah, I killed Dagather, I think. Nothing really happens. I basically think uh, here is Azura. You no longer bear the burden of prophecy. You have achieved your destiny. You are free. The doomed dreamer's folly, Lord Dagoth's temptation, the tribunal's seduction, the god's heart freed, the prophecy fulfilled. All faith sealed and sins redeemed. If you have pity, mourn the lost, but let the weeping cease. Light is gone, and the sun's golden honey gilds the land. Hail, Savior, Hortatorn, and Nerevarine. Your people look to you for protection. Monster and villains, great and small, still threaten the people of Ardenfell. Enemies and evils abound, 
yet indomitable will might rid Morrowind to all its ills. For you, a thanks I ended the blight. Our gift and token given. Come, take this thing from the hand of God. Alright, your journal has been updated. So she gave me the Ring of Azura, which does Night Eye on self for 30, 20 points and Restore Fatigue. Nice. Alright, so I'm done with this. I, I cured and saved everyone. Um, Dagoth Ur welcomes you, Nerevar, my old friend. But to this place where destiny is made, why have you come unprepared? Come unprepared. Until I see you're better prepared, we have nothing to discuss. This is the place of destiny, and destiny can may only be shaped by the holder of Kagranik's tools. I do not know what you think to accomplish, but raise your hand against me and I shall destroy you. I should be able to beat him up. This is weird. This isn't Dagatha. That was so chamber. Okay, I'm try this out. Oh. What a fool you are. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating innocence. How could you be so naive? There is no escape. No recall or intervention can work in this place. Come, lay oh, down wow, your weapons. It is not too late for my mercy. I don't know if he just keeps healing himself or what, but I should be able to beat him up. I'm over encumbered now. Let me restore my strength, which lets me walk around. And I'll use my restore health. And I'll use my other restore health. Because if you lose your strength, you get over encumbered. And you're unable to, like, run. Alright, so. Can't really keep doing more things, I guess. Maybe just, like, jump into the lava. See what happens. 